Hi, we are at uh, Zoller stall at Imtex 2023. Today we are having Christoph Zoller himself. It was very nice uh, meeting you today. Welcome to Machine Maker. So, uh, you often come to India, right? Yes, uh, I'm very proudly come to India because uh, also to be here at the Imtech show because I'm I came the first time in 2007 to India and uh, for the Imtech show and in because in 2004 our company we have decided that we will hire two Indian members one for sales one for service and our business was then directly starting in India and then in 2004 five six we had to quite a uh, reasonable success for us and then uh, I decided we should have uh, participation at the Imtech show and uh, so we set up some people from Germany to come here and then uh, we set up a booth in Hall 3 and it was the, the exhibition garden was not even finished there was no window in there the, the, the roads were not finished traffic and uh, the traffic we needed two and a half hours to go out of the parking lot and uh, it was for me first time to India. It was uh, amazing, but it was uh, for me uh, the show. Also, we met our customers, and our customers tell, told me at that time, Mr. Zoller, your product is very good, but you should look to maybe get a company here because the, the work on how you provide the parts, how you do the service, should be better, uh, more to the standard of Zoller. So and then I, at the show, I already decided we will open a company here, Solo India. And I came back in May, April, May 2007, and I went to Pune because there was our biggest customer, Tata Motors, and then we opened Solo India. And then for two years, I came to India every two weeks. I was here. So I, I was that time working in Asia, so I set up some other companies there, but I went two weeks to that location and then two weeks, one, two weeks to India. I traveled all over India, set up our offices and then participated at the shows and since then every Imtech show I came here. I'm, uh, I always say I'm already 25% Indian. <laughs> so, so for me, uh, India, uh, I know many customers here. And then today at the Imtech show 2023, Certainly, it's a long time now because uh, four years uh, we had a horrible time all over the world. Now we are back here and many customers and we have the biggest booth we had at Imtech show so far. We have room and especially our customers are coming today to me and saying, Mr. Zoller, you have a perfect team, your product, everything you have done, the setup is perfect. And so for me, it's, uh, I'm very happy to get this feedback and uh, this information. So, and, and I'm also happy for India because it seems industry is uh, performing quite well and uh, moving forward in the right direction. Our customers have projects and so for us, we are very happy to have here our booth and our team. And so for this, this is for me India and I'm happy to be here. Uh, it's very amazing yeah. to hear you also brought some small, uh, you know, memories when 2007 yeah. was the first time the Imtex uh, started here in yes, in BIEC, the first yes. time and uh, you also started and recently yes. I believe uh, Zoller India celebrated 15 years. 15 in years India. in India, yes. And you are a very known name now how and I think it's a proud moment for you the way Zoller yes. has grown in India giving a lot of tool management solutions. Yes. So how you see the future of Zoller in India? Yeah, I, you know the, the way on how customers are growing uh, certainly our machine, our customers always say, I'm ah, Mr. Zoller, your machine, but it, I don't make money with it. You don't see immediately the benefits. Only when you go to the other machine makers, you buy a CNC machine, you know how many parts you make per hour, per day, per week, per month, per year. And for every part you get money. And for our product, you don't see that. But in order to have these machines running effectively, you need Zoller. Zoller tool presetters, Zoller tool management. And the nice part what we see here at the show is that with the solar solutions, we can build our customers further. Our company, we have focused over the years, first of all, certainly to measure all types of cutting tools. So today in, in India, electronic industry is growing. Micro tools, we can measure micro tools in the same way our customers who get orders for windmill products have to measure very big tools. So we measure very small tools, we measure very big tools. We can measure with the solar product range all tools this is our basis. But then around this, we have developed the solar solutions for tool management, tool management software, tool management hardware to manage cutting tools well, to 
with our shrink fit system to provide here a solution, tool balancing, Zoller ZIT code, Zoller ID chip technology to show how data is actually entered into CNC machine controls and customers who are growing they feel also more the pain of organizing their works more better because if you have five machines or suddenly ten machines or fifteen machines or twenty machines the cost around the machines is increasing because machines are one time bought, the building is one time bought, you pay the bank but your operational cost depends on a good tool management and for this I see Zoller certainly in a very good position especially we have a good setup in India we have a good team and we have the right product to support uh, and be part of this uh, growing industry. Yeah. I'm very happy to see that you have very good uh, you know, uh, knowledge about India, Indian market and I'm sure that you know, all your customers are going to get benefited by the ecosystem you created around the tooling and uh, all yeah. the tool management processes. Yes. So I also uh, le learned that you know, Zoller have completed 75 years, if I yes. believe, right? So how it started, the journey yes. started? Certainly, uh, my grandfather Alfred Zoller uh, started uh, our company in Germany on 1st of September 1945. Yeah. So, certainly uh, a time where Germany was uh, responsible for the Second World War, very bad for Germany and a uh, tough time for our country. Yeah. Uh, we were basically a destroyed country and, uh, yeah, and at that time things had to be repaired and my grandfather was a mechanical engineer. Uh, he was, uh, because of his knowledge, he, had, he was not a soldier in the Second World War, he was an engineer building aircraft engines and uh, then after the war he used his knowledge to repair. Uh, in, yeah, in the area of Stuttgart there are big companies there, there is a Bosch, there is Mercedes, there is Siemens, there are many other machine builders, so he repaired machines, he repaired also household equipment, uh, butchery machines, uh, bakery machines, even down to the toys, he even repair toys and typewriters, pencils, everything in the daily life. Uh, so this was the start for our company, a repair works. And then slowly, end of the 40s, beginning of the 50s, works started. We made special parts, special fixtures for some customers in our area. And then my grandfather basically entered into a chop shop, making parts for other companies on order. And then he had the idea, because mostly of these parts were turning parts, turn parts, some mill parts, but then he developed a tooling system for quick change in his own machines and then measured them off, offline to be more faster with the tool exchange. And then our neighbors, uh, similar like in India, the industrial zone, there are neighbors, they see what he was doing and they said, Alfred, what you are doing here? And they said, I, I want the same. And then he, he, he made some same items for some of his friends, of the neighbors, and then he had the idea that he should go to the market with it. And then we started to sell this product in South Germany, and then yeah, we also uh, bought a patent from a Swiss company to, for a tool change system for a turning machine. And then we yeah, started uh, getting more market in Germany, in uh, Switzerland, in Austria, in France even. And this was the start for our company. And then my father uh, joined the company beginning the 60s, first as an education apprenticeship, and then he studied machine engineering. And, and then actually he worked at Heidelberger Druckmaschinen, a very famous German company, and he not even wanted to join his father's company. There were 25 people and he, he had no idea to go there. He even thought he'd tell my grandfather not to join the company because he was happy in Heidelberger Druckmaschinen with his wife, my mother, and so, but then my grandfather got sick and my grandmother called him, even during the works, and said, your father is in the hospital, you need to come. And then he threw everything down, went to his boss and said, I'm sorry, I have to quit, I have to go back. And then he went back and he worked in his father's company. It was. April 1968. Yeah. It's, it's, it's something yeah. I believe engineering goes inside the Zoller family. Yes. And that is what the growth you are able to see here, yeah. the solution what is coming from the heart. Yes, exactly. We, we are with the heart in our company. Yeah, we, uh, we talk about, in Christmas is our big festival, we even talk under the Christmas tree about tool presenters. Yeah. Not just India, uh, Mr. Zoller, 
uh, we wish Zolar to reach more, expand globally and give great solutions to people for a higher productivity. Thanks yes. for sharing your time. Yes, and we wish you all you. the best. Thank you very much for your time and thank you for giving us this uh, platform to talk about this.